comes with a clutch strike on lane 25, but uh, if you take a look at her sin as possibilities, 280 if he takes this one off the sheet. Well, Jimmy's still potential 268, so anything can happen. Oh, plenty of room again. Roll up, and Hersina again with a clutch strike as he answers on lane 26. It's, a, it's amazing. I don't know uh, what he did since the second frame, but he gets this ball way wide again like he did in the second frame. Now it's hooking back to the pocket and not going high. So he's made some kind of an adjustment, and it's paying off. He's up by 12 pins, can make it 22 with one more. Stays down nicely with it. Is it, it. going to get it? Yes. The messenger delivers, and Hersina comes charging back with a strike in the ninth, and he cannot lose. Watch the head pin, Denny. Watch the head pin. It goes to the sideboard, comes off, stays on the lane, and you could see it was going to get it at this point. Big strike in the ninth frame. Jimmy has to have this one to cut that 22-pin lead to 12. Waste very little time. Up the track it goes. Certain with a left and certain responds. Boy, we have seen some tremendous pressure bowling here in the championship game. Down by 12 pins. Same shot he had the last frame on this lane, only the eight pin doesn't stand this time. How'd you like to shoot 268 and not be able to close out the guy you're bowling against? What he basically wants to do, to, he's thinking that, but get the first one, cuts it to two pins. Puts him in the 250s. Will it carry? No. Just a little light fingered. That same type of 710 hit when you get the seven pin win out in a hurry. Makes the spare and a strike. He's going to finish with 247, forcing her Senna to mark. First order of business to make sure you take out the 10. Right. No charge. Beautiful exhibition of bowling in the championship round this evening by Huntsville, Alabama's Jimmy Certain, but uh, he may come up a little bit short. I mean, he's going to wind up here with eight. If he strikes here, wind up with eight strikes, two ten pins, and an eight pin, and he's might lose. Tough game. Another 10, finishes with 246. Beautiful performance for Jimmy Certain, who averages better than 230 in the championship round this evening, but Hersina, as Mike has already said, needs a mark. I think if I've added it right, nine on the first ball will be enough. Give it room. That's it. And Hersena has finally captured his first PBA Senior Championship. And Susan has just now realized that uh, he had lost seven consecutive times in the championship round. And to win is so sweet. And she was applauding enough for, to make up for everybody else in the crowd. <laughs> It's funny because I asked John before the telecast, are you going to do anything differently to try and win this evening? He said, well, I'm normally not too emotional, but tonight I think I'm going to come out and try and get him a little bit. Well, he comes out with 269, so I you just did get him a little bit. And that's enough to get the job done. Jimmy Certain finishes second. John Hersina with his first PBA Senior Championship. And it'll be one that he will remember a very, very long time. The winner of the $75,000 AMF Bobcat Senior Open here at Weber Lanes in St. Charles. We'll be back to chat with our newest champion.